Yo, what's up everyone? My name is Kikus. Um, I decided I'm gonna do another part of uh, Dark Souls. Um, this isn't where we left off last time. Um, I tried recording part 2 just a minute ago, but after a minute I realized my microphone wasn't working. So what I did is I walked to the end of a cliff and a giant bird came and picked me up and he just dropped me here. So, um, as this will not be just a test, this will be a full playthrough, ah, not a full playthrough, but this is going to be a let's play of Dark Souls. I'm going to explain the few basics of the game. This is a bonfire. If you rest at a bonfire, you will heal. And the Estus flasks, as you can see in the left corner, are uh, replenished. You get 10 uh, at Firelink Shrine right here, but at any other bonfire you get 5. Um, when you rest at a bonfire, all the enemies in the area or all the enemies in the world will respawn. So if you just fall a horde of enemies and you're going to rest at the bonfire, all of them will respawn. Um, by talking to this guy, he will explain uh, what you have to do. Well, what do we have here? You must be a new arrival. But there's no salvation here. <sighs> well, there are. Actually, two bells of awakening. Ring them both. Not much to go on. So, off you go. <laughs> so you gotta ring two bells. One up above and one down below. Uh, the one up above is uh, after the Bell Gargoyle fight. And the one down below is after the Chaos Witch Quaylock fight. So we're gonna try to ring those bells in this playthrough. First, I'm gonna level up. You can level up at Bonfire. Uh, let's see... I'm gonna up my endurance so I can uh, wear this. I thought he was dead. He only had one HP left. Uh, there's a guy up there throwing fire bombs, but I want to get this item. God, fucking damn! Let's drink an Estus flask. And let's kill this guy. As you can see, I'm already ambushed by lots of enemies, and this is just the first part of the game. This this is just an easy ambush. And our soul. The souls you find are consumables. You can consume them and you will get souls. Because the souls, as you can see in the uh, right corner, are the things you use to uh, buy items and level up and all that sort of things. It's basically the money in the game. Parrying him didn't work. Fuck. Uh, parrying is um, hitting his arm uh, with which he was gonna attack you. So you're hitting his arm and he is uh, guard broken and you can uh, do a critical hit on him. And that's the dragon. Oh. 
Oh, might want to fall back here. So I'm a, a knight. I'm a heavy build. I need a lot of uh, endurance, equip load. So that's the uh, main thing I'm gonna level up in this run. Here's another bonfire. So, as you see, I'm gonna light the bonfire. Lighting the bonfire doesn't respawn enemies, but resting at a bonfire does. I rest uh, at a bonfire, and as you can see, the guy there I just killed respawned. So, first, I'm gonna consume uh, the souls I just got. And I'm gonna level up at the bonfire. So let's see what kind of armor I can wear right now. Yeah, that's cool. That's good enough. Oh, he's not dead yet. Nope. Oh shit, I aggroed another one. Oh. There's supposed to be some treasure in here. Oh, fuck. So yeah, I know this game uh, much better than uh, Dark Souls 2. Ah yeah, Black Fire Mounts. But I also know uh, Dark Souls 2 pretty well right now. I already... Um, yeah, I didn't complete the game yet, but I already have two uh, characters. On which I'm pretty far in. Oh, he's also trying <laughs> to kill me with fire bombs. Uh, there's gold pine resin in here, if I'm not mistaken. Oh no, that's not here. Oh wait, it is. Yeah, this is gold pine resin, which will um, put electricity on your weapon, which we're gonna use at the next boss. Ah, uh, no, wrong way. Uh, you wanna go in here first? Oh wait, you don't wanna go in there first. Because I already aggroed an enemy. These guys are... Uh, I hate them. They won't attack you until you attack first. Or they will just shield bash you. Like that. And then you can attack them. So. But when you attack them, they'll just guard. And attack you. Oh, <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Just let these guys attack you, and then do a couple strong attacks. Yeah. 
down there is a black knight, which you don't want to fight right now. Uh, you want to come up here, and you want to go down, because that was a trap. Oh, he's not there yet. Okay, we're gonna fight the second boss in this video. He's drinking Estus too. Ooh, he's dropped something. Titanite shard, sweet. Titanite uh, is the stuff you use to um, upgrade armor and weapons in this game. You use Titanite shards, which are the little stones to upgrade to, I think, plus 3 or plus 5. Then you got large Titanite shards. And you got Titanite chunks. So, you want to go up here, kill the sniper guys. Then you want to drink a Nestus flask. And equip some... Oh, I already equipped the gold pine resin. Alright, this is where the second boss comes in. Right there. You want to just sprint back. Climb up the ladder. Fast. And you want to do a jump attack. Oh, I thought I was getting hurt by that. And that is the second boss of Towers Demon. Pretty easy. Get a lot of souls from that. I think 9,000. Oh, 3,000. I thought it was 9. But that's okay. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna go back to the bonfire real quick using an Omer bone. And I'm gonna end the episode there. A homeward bone sends you to the last bonfire rest of that. So you can use it like this after a boss fight. So I'm gonna level up my endurance again. And that concludes the second part of Dark Souls. And I try to use a gesture, but I cannot find the right button for it. I don't think I can use gestures right now. Maybe I can. Nope. Well, I guess. See you guys.